Okay, so we got the transfer switch where, where my solar uh, power um, can be direct is directed through. Basically, this controls the direction of the current of my solar power I'm generating on my roof. So I have a couple of things. What I do again is I I hook up the positive lead um, that comes from my roof and goes through that disconnect box. It comes out of that disconnect box, um, goes to the common lead on the back of this transfer switch. Then there's a position one lead and a position two. When position one lead goes from this transfer switch um, to the battery and therefore charges the battery. Or if I uh, connect my, uh, and I have a lead behind here for position two that goes from position two to the grid tie inverter, to my positive here. So right now we're in position two, um, so my panels are producing not much right now, 160 watts. My panels are in a very, they're poorly mounted, um, directional wise, angle wise. So, um, I sh I, and I'll get up to about 200 even with my poor mounting right now. But that's where I'm at right now. So you see about 160 watts coming in um, at this time of the day. So I take my transfer switch. I change this to position. I'll turn it off. Now there's no power coming in. I just killed the power. You see zeros coming in. Now I take that power and I'm going to go to position one. It'll come through my charge controller. So right now you can see, uh, ba, 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 let me zero that out. Right now we've got zero coming in. I'm going to turn this to position one and the current will now be directed to my batteries via this charge controller. So now you can see I've got 12.91 amps coming in times 12 should be roughly 160. Um, so we just redirected it to the charge controller. So how, uh, and I'll go into how I hook this up in a minute, but anyway, so now um, I am basically charging my batteries uh, by keeping that at position one. And then later I can run off my batteries independently um, without the grid, it's considered off grid. Um, or I can just take that power, send it to the grid tie, and therefore, what it'll do is it'll that power will go into my house. It'll be used by my house. If it's not being used by my house, it'll slow or re actually turn back my meter. And then it'll go to a neighbor's house. Um, actually, right now, that, that noise is I'm going into a divert mode with my charge controller because my batteries are too charged. They're charged up to their capacity here. So let me just back this off. Okay.